If they get rowdy, I'm gonna need you guys to tear them up in the comments, all right? Like, y'all got my back, I got your back, all right? So let's do this together. I want my name to be a household product. Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to another. Make sure you comment, like, and subscribe. Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to another video. If you are new here, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you comment, like, and subscribe. If you're not new here and you're a Yoji, please make sure, y'all already know what to do. Wait, what am I saying? <laughs> Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to another video. My name is Jose, if you are new here, thank you so much for watching. If you're not new here, y'all already know what to do, so make sure y'all comment, like, and subscribe. And let's get on with this video. So I wanted to come on here and just let you guys know about my New Year's resolutions. Honey, you better work and let them know, diva. <sighs> there are many a plethora of New Year's resolutions that I want to accomplish, but these are the four that I'm focused on, focusing on this quarter and for the rest of the year. And I wanted to tell y'all because I just ordered books and they came in. So my first New Year's resolution is I want to learn a new language, Japanese to be exact. One of my dream vacations is to go to Japan. I loved Japan, Japan like, oh my incredible. God. So why not try to learn the language before I go there? And I don't want to like be fluent and be like, oh, I know Japanese, you know what I mean? So I just want to learn to get by. So I ordered these books. So the first thing that I want to do is learn their, um, alphabet if you will so the first one that i ordered these two books and it is the hiragana for kids and uh, katakana for kids as well and it also got this japanese word word search so it's like why not i'm trying to learn the, the alphabet i'm treating this as if i was a little tiny tot for christ you know a little a little kid i feel like that's the best way to learn and i want to learn some a uh, couple of phrases here and there just to really learn this before i go to japan and i'm gonna go to japan and watch mark my words but that is my first new year's resolution i really want to learn a new language so arigato gozaimasu on to the next one all right, so the next one, the, my next New Year resolution is I want to lose weight. Recently, I've kind of fallen off the wagon and it's not a good look. I'm really trying to make this year my year and I have a few places that I'm going to visit and I want to be able to feel comfortable um, I'm, I got the new gym going on. It's gonna open uh, pretty soon, hopefully this month. Now, I'm really mad. And uh, I have the class pass. And I also, like, for the, like, aesthetic gym vibes, I wanna wear, like, those, um, the tight, long sleeve gym sh shirts that, you know, people be wearing. I mean, I could wear it now. Let me post it up here. You know, boop, 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 boop. I want to wear, I could wear them now, but I don't have that confidence to be like skin, uh, you know, like skin tight. Why are you gay? So like, you know, like I, I feel constricted. I feel like I got to breathe. I already can't breathe with loose shirts and y'all, I'm, I'm not going to try, I'm not going to do that to myself, you know, but yeah, I'm, eat healthy, eat right, and get tight. That's what I'm trying to do. The third New Year's resolution that I want to achieve is I want a better plan. I want to be more organized. I was watching Brandon. He was, he had this video. Let me show, post this right here. He had a he was talking about like the planner that he uses for like to organize like his like daily stuff and his work. And that really was like, oh, I need to get myself a new planner. So that's okay. Let me try to get. The, let me show you all the one that I was using for 2023. I'm back. So this is the one that I was using for 2023. I got it off of Amazon. I believe they updated. Can y'all see it? Daily Designs. The Daily Designer. This is the one that I was using for 2023. I feel like it really helped me out. It helped me not to double book and everything. And I want to take 
organizing and uh, start do using a planner. But the thing is, I don't know if I want to use like paper, like traditional planners, or if I want to do the digital planner. So in order for me to do the digital planner, I have to get an iPad. I don't know if I want to do the paper way or the digital way. So I got to figure that out now because the year has already started, all right? But yeah, so this is what I wanted to use. I'll link it. If anybody wants to try this, the 2024 version, I believe they have it out. If they have it out, I'll link it down below. I do get commission, so if you do cl click the link, it is, um, I get paid. So my last resolution that I wanna focus on this year is my fashion, all right? I wanna start wearing more fashion pieces. <laughs> I want to be more comfortable. That's an, everything. Everything that I'm doing here is gonna fall into place with like my fashion because if I want to look good, feel good, smell good. I mean, I already smell good, but if I if I want to look good and feel good, I feel like my fashions has to be on point. My body has to be right. And this is just me. If you feel comfortable wearing whatever you want with your specific body type, either if you're slim or on the thicker side or in the middle, that's on you. But right now, it's um, I don't feel comfortable with the way that I am now. But yeah, I'm trying to be a fashion baddie. One of my uh, subscribe met him because he subscribed to my channel. His name is Pedro. Shout out to DC. Get your shot. Get your shot. Shout out to you, Pedro. I love his style. His style is what I want my style to be. No, I don't think you understand. I'm obsessed. I'm very inspired by this man. And I'll post his information here or here. So if you want to go check him out and follow him on Instagram, he takes traditional, like what you would consider traditional feminine pieces. And he mixes them with like, um, like other traditional masculine pieces and makes it look effortlessly like so chic and it's just very it's like the kind of look that i want to it's the kind of look that i want to uh, eventually achieve because i like the whole because i have long hair i love the whole androgynous look and the whole like fashion has no gender and like you can wear whatever you want and that's the kind of vibe that I like, so I'm very inspired by him. And yeah, so go check him out, like I said. And right now, I'm doing un caldo de pollo because it's been really cold. So yeah, I just wanted to come on here to let y'all know my New Year's resolutions, and I will see you guys a little later. Sorry, this I'm trying to keep this closed. On my last video, that was open, and it was bothering the hell out of me. Close the cabinet. Sometimes I forget to close it. You know, guys, they forget to close stuff. But yeah, I'm gonna try to keep it closed from now on. All right, see y'all tomorrow. All right, y'all. Um, I just stopped by a GNC. I was gonna take this camera, but I got so nervous because, first of all, <laughs> With this camera alone, it like freaks me out to like vlog in public. And then not only do, does that happen, but I go into the GMC, GNC, and then I saw like two gym bros going. I don't know why, but then gym bros make me so nervous. I feel like they're gonna beat me up. I feel like I'm in middle school. <sighs> but I gotta go to, I'm going to my friend's house and I gotta go to um, a CVS. So I'm gonna take y'all with me if it's the last thing I do. Yo, I can't find this freaking thing. Let me ask somebody. Excuse me. Excuse me. Oh my God, he did not want to help me. He's like, why are you bothering me? I'm like, bitch, you got a red shirt. All right, we got it. I'm gonna head out and catch y'all later. Oh my God, I literally bought this ointment for my friend's baby and I, I hit no receipt like an idiot. I was nervous. So I'm just gonna tell her it's like 50 bucks. <laughs> Good morning, guys. Um, yes, I'm wearing the same outfit because we're going to get an oil change. 
and I'm going there. Last time I went there, I went right when they opened, and they were like, well, we're not ready, so you're gonna have to wait anyways. I'm like, yeah, no worries, girl. I'm like, take your time, because the place that I go to, it's in downtown Fort Lauderdale, and they, it's literally 10 minutes. You're in and out. The place is literally called in and out and it's not the burger place. I've never had that burger place. Anyways, so we're gonna go there. Um, it's like, what, what, what time is it right now? It's 8.55. So yeah, let's go head on over there. And then we also got to, I'm gonna try to vlog in public with this, with you guys, but I get so nervous because you guys be so rowdy and y'all like bring attention. And uh, it's just so like, I'm like, sorry, it's just my friends. Like I'll, I'll try to calm them down. Like y'all, y'all really bring attention and I get so nervous, so anxious, but let, let's try to like, Keep it, yeah, y'all are at a 72, I'm gonna need y'all at a five, okay? Okay, so let's go, all right? Okay, y'all, I got the car back, and literally, boom, bam, thank you, ma'am. I was out of there in like 10, 15 minutes, and they changed, it was $140. Are you kidding me? That's a lot, but you know what? Quick service, I'm good with it, and they changed my, um, well, they, they charged me, but they changed my, the windshield wipers, and the little thing in the bottom of my car was like, I was ignoring it, and it was coming off, and they like, tied that shit up for me, and I was like, thank you so much, guys, and, this okay um but yeah so literally if you're if you're in the fort lauderdale area come to in and out oil change and they will get you ready oh and also these people they don't they only do oil changes so they're not like oh you got to do this you got to do that we can we charge you for this and blah 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 like literally no they just care about the oil change and you're going to be here you're going to be in and out just like the name suggested so we're going to um like i said tj max marshall's because i'm trying to look for a planner Okay, y'all, we just got here to TJ Maxx and I'm nervous vlogging, y'all. But listen, if somebody, if they get rowdy, I'm gonna need you guys to tear them up in the comments, all right? Like, y'all got my back, I got your back, all right? So let's do this together. Also, like I said, it's my, it, it, this is new for me. So if y'all get a lot of double chin, I'm sorry, I wanna apologize in advance, but y'all know, I'm just nervous. Okay, let's go. Hey, how you doing? Okay, y'all, I'm out here. It's so gloomy. Gloomy, doomy, scooby dooby. <sighs> I'll see you guys inside. I'm already getting nervous. Why am I nervous? I don't know these people. These people don't know me. Okay, y'all, focus. I'm trying to find the little agenda place. All right, let's get this. Oh, look at this. Live by the sun, love by the moon. Not me trying to cast some spells. Are these just like notebooks? I need me like dates, a calendar, you know? Oh look, this one says 2024. But why is it so girly? I mean, I don't mind that, but like, Let me look through this and then I'll be right back. Okay, y'all, look at this one. I found Juan this to one. the office, Juan. Juan, um, I think I'm gonna get this one. Okay, y'all, we finished. It wasn't that bad. There also wasn't a lot of people there, um, but I ended up getting the brown one for 2024. I wanna go to Target. I just wanna see something <laughs> real quick. All right, but we're going to Target after this. We're not going to Marshall's because I already got the, I already got the, where's my car? Over there. 
I already got the um, the planner that I wanted. So let's go to Target. Okay, y'all, we are at Target. I just want to see something real quick. Um, I just want to see something. We'll be there in a minute. <laughs> Is this a sign? They don't got my size, though. Oh, I'm so mad. Okay, y'all, I'm in the electronic department. I just want to see something. Okay, we are leaving Target. I saw what I needed to see, but I will show you guys at the house. All right. Okay, y'all, I just got back from um, running those little errands, and I just want to show you guys what I got. So I got this planner. I showed you guys there, but I, I wanted this one because the other one that, that most of them that were there were like, girly but not like girly like in a sense like feminine but like little girl you know what i'm saying this one also comes with the stickers and stuff so i got this one and then i got this little pink stuff i don't that's not important but then at target i went to go get more um razors this is the one brand that i use and uh, i get the five blade one and then i got a refill for i already filled it up but I got a refill for the hand soap. I love this smell. So, so originally I was I was gonna go to Target regardless, but I wasn't gonna film because I needed to get those two items specifically. And then uh, I was like, let me just see something. And I saw and I conquered. I got an iPad, girl. <laughs> I know I've been wanting an iPad. Everybody tell everybody was telling me not to get one, but you know what? I got it. I was thinking, I'm like, this I want to use for like my personal stuff, and then I got this one. They're like, oh, so if you got an iPad, are you gonna return this one? Why did you get this one uh, to begin with? Well, first off, I didn't know I was gonna get one today, but I knew I wanted an iPad. This is gonna be strictly for work purposes. I was looking, I was when I told you I was watching Brandon's video and he kept his separate and I was like, you know what? He got a point because I don't want my job, it's already stressful as it is and I don't want it mixing with like my everyday stuff. Cause when I clock out, I'm done. I don't want you, I'll, I'll get to it when at the hours of operation, all right? If it's Saturday, past five before nine i'll get to it uh during hours of operation and i just want to keep everything separate i'm relying on the calendar that i have at work and i leave it at work so if i write things down i can like i can be better prepared for the next day the following week what i gotta do deadlines that i gotta meet and you know just stuff like that but then um the reason i got the ipad is just for like my personal stuff and i'm gonna do an unboxing later but there's a little bts and i'm gonna get like some accessories for the ipad so i'm waiting i'm gonna order them now i'm gonna have to wait for them to get here so yeah i can't wait and i'm gonna go ahead and cook some food clean up my house and just and also i was telling my friend that like my place just feels so like gloomy I need like more light. If anybody has any suggestions on how I can brighten this place up, please leave it in the comments down below, all right? But yeah, I will see you guys later or tomorrow. Bye. Hello, y'all. It is a Sunday. I didn't film anything at all. Literally, I was just spending all my, all, all my morning editing. So, and I forgot, I was looking at the edits and I didn't um, close out the vlog. So I'm just using this opportunity to just close it out real fast. Like I said, I'm just getting ready for work and I wanted to close out, I want to be a good YouTuber and I close this out properly. And I just wanted to say thank you so much for watching and hit the like button. And I will see you guys next week. Bye.